Hi my friends, how are you? It's long since I was here last. I went on a long holiday but now I'm back on full swing. My name is Maggie and on my channel I talk more about narcissists, their stories, their traits and how they abuse people. On today's topic I'm going to talk about how do narcissists steal your dignity. You'll agree with me that when you are treated normally, you'll behave normally. You will behave yourself. You will act yourself. You will be yourself. You will not fake anything. But now that you are with a narcissist, they want to instill the fear in you. Fear is the dominant factor in your life. Because they know once they instill that fear, you won't be yourself and you'll be like you've lost your mind. So every time you're around a narcissist, you'll be like that person who walks on an eggshell. You fear to trigger them. You fear to annoy them. So if you always, you're in constant fear of annoying other person, then you will be ripped of your dignity and you will not act like yourself. You will not behave yourself. I would say this way, you will not be free to express even yourself to other people. Because you fear, you don't know what reaction will come with any re anything that you do. What reaction will come with the narcissist? Because small things trigger them. And the fear they instill in you will make it easy for them to control you. Because that is what they love. They want to control you and that's why they instill that fear in you. So to stop this from happening to you, you need to create a strong boundary. You need to know how to say no when it's still, when it gets to a certain point where a narcissist wants to instill that pain in you that emotional abuse just learn to say no because it is possible and the day you learn to say no to the narcissist it will turn around because they are the ones who will start fearing you because what narcissists fear most is rejection and being discarded and that's why normally they want to create the chaos within the relationship so that they get that opportunity to discard you. So they start, once they've, they've created the fear in you and you start now behaving in fear because you are not behaving like normal person, you are not yourself in everything. So that is when they thrive. And then now they start devaluing you, which means that whatever you do will not be good enough. Because in a normal relationship, you'll want to do your best. But with a narcissist, your best will never be good enough. So what you need to learn is how to create that boundary for yourself. How to create that me moment for yourself. Because the moment you will create the me moment for yourself, it will be a big blow to the narcissist. Because now it will be like their mask have fallen and now the real them is can now be seen with other people and what narcissist is after and what they care about is their image so if there's a way that you can make that expose that fake image of themselves then you've won so in today's topic i just wanted to introduce this topic why do they steal your dignity and uh, I'll stop there that will be part one of this one and then I'll continue on part two on the details of how you can create that boundary and the things you should look for so thank you so much for watching please if you haven't subscribed please do and for those who have subscribed I really appreciate for those who keep on coming back to my channel to 
even watch what I had sent before. I really appreciate. Please share, comment, and like. And let's meet on the next video. Thank you.